Right, hello everybody, welcome back to Mix Lakeside Railway. Um, first things first, um, celebration of the layout. Uh, 700,000 views now. It's achieved from when I started, so um, that's fantastic. Um, the subscribers haven't gone up very much though, but um, not to worry about that. But 700,000 is, is, you know, historical number. And um, well pleased, well pleased. Uh, right, we've just been to the Great Electric Train Show, and what a great show it was. Uh, I think Pete Walkman's layout probably drew quite a load of people, but I found each year the venue is getting more and more packed, so I think it was a great idea, whoever organised the uh, show this year, to have the extra car park with the buses which was very good. I did I did um, hear during the day that um, that got gridlocked as well and one of the buses broke down but I still think it was better than um, having a crammed pack or trying to find somewhere to park around the venue. Um, so that's it and I hope they um, do this every year because I can only see the, the uh, venue getting more and more busy as local shows and that have cut, um, it's closed due to Covid have never re returned so that's it um first of all a big thank you for everybody i met at the show uh, i'll try and remember most of them i mean alan of uh, dragon junction nice to see you again alan and thank you for the pony trap um i've already got mine on the layout a little bit of painting on it weathering it up a little bit i'll show you that in the video but thanks very much again nice to see you and your wife um susanna nice to meet susanna um, I also met Charlie, um, Timber, Timbercraft is it, um, uh, Graham Falston, bumped into Graham Falston and also Paul of uh, Sandalin Junction with um, Julian from New Zealand but I also had a, um, a loyal uh, follower, uh, Matt, came from Cornwall, all the way up from Cornwall, five and a half hours it, it took him to get there. But what a surprise to see Matt turn up on the day. Um, thank you for that, Matt. Um, so very glad to meet you. And um, we did have a really good chat. But um, yeah, other than that, um, everything everything was good on the day. I managed to buy uh, a couple of things from Wagon Works, and I bought one more loco, which was the Backman class 70 um, I haven't got it on the lap at the moment I did have a problem with the decoder if it comes back by the time I do all the videos I will clip it on the end and show you that but other than that so on this one we're celebrating 700,000 views so on this video I'm going to show you um, a variety of long trains that I'll run on the on the layout so uh, we won't hang around so let's get on with it and keep those comments coming and if you haven't seen the channel before please subscribe um, also one thing I did forget was Peter Dixon I meant to see Peter Dixon at the show looked everywhere for you Peter um, I did ask Alan and others others around that they said yeah you were there but I couldn't find your tour mate and I'm sorry that we didn't meet up and also Mark Singleton, Mark, one of my early subscribers from way back. I was hoping to meet you at the show, and for some reason as well, we just didn't bump into each other. So I'm sorry I missed you again this time, but I'm sure at one point we'll make arrangements and we will meet up. So anyway, thank you everybody for saying hello to me at the show, and let's get on with the video. Right, bye for now. Well now Alan, yep, thanks very much, there's the pony trap, sit it down there, yep, bit of weathering, bit of roughage growing around it, lovely, and thanks very much, and there's your new card, cheers mate, right, this is uh, one of my latest purchases, I got this before we went to the Great Electric Train Show, the Axoscale 37607 in DRS. 
Um, this is now number, I think, 39 of the fleet now. I bought this because I say I like the wide pack lights. I haven't got any of these before and I like the light above the cab. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the sounds, but we'll start it up. And I'll put my lights on. Cab lights fitted with Model U, two, two cabin crew in here, I prefer Model U um, to all, rather than the Acro Scout, I find their models, they're alright but they're a little bit bumpety and the painting, the, you, you've got to repaint them anyway but I like the Model U, I've used these now for ages now and I'm well impressed. So, this is the 37 and you'll see this going around on the layout but I say um, I did buy the DCC version and then purchased the factory fitted decoder and the Acrofresh speaker so yeah lovely loco I'll just give it a little start up first Right, yo, guys. We'll start the session off with uh, we've got the Pendolino running around, which is double powered. I've changed the wheels on the back, so we're double powered. Class 17 Freightliner is doing the tanker run. Another new loco on here today is a, a Curious Shell 37607 with the wipe lights. I purchased that as well, and that's pulling the timber wagon. Uh, I also purchased at the Great Electric Train Show uh, Class 70 Backman in Colas Rail, but. I've had a problem with the decoder on it at the moment, overeating, I had trouble with the wheels that were sticking, which I think it's caused a bit of pressure, so um, that won't be running, I don't think, on this one at the moment, unless it comes back within a couple of days and I'm still doing the videos, then obviously I'll put it back on, otherwise I'll show it at a later date, but also on the track, I've now put more accessories in with the track point rodding and boxes. And also I've got on track is I had the uh, class 92 in Virgin. So with this session, I'm just going to show you a variety of long trains that I can run. Right, here comes the Pendolino and the 92, both in Virgin. Pendolino runs well with it being double powered, took away the traction tyres, which I've got to do this with the, 90, the 91, I'm sorry, not 92, 91 on the rear is 82 a dvt but i do have the original dvt in these new colors that 
again it come with no lights and I haven't fitted rear lights to it yet so I've put the Virgin DVT on the old version so here comes the um, DRS Right, Pendolino's going to depart now, platform one, up across the new points now, and then back up one to track four.
perfect no problems at all that's the first time I've used it so good bit of work down there by myself please with that let's carry on Right, that was a class 50 network southeast game game pass. Uh, next one we've got coming up is a class 60 WS pulling the sea cows.